So welcome to Armour 3 Mod Spotlights in my brand shiny new mod testing facility. Uh, I am aware that things are clipping. So this facility here is something that I threw together in an afternoon in Eden. And as this series progresses, we'll be developing on this, adding new functionality and stuff as we need it. So given this is the first week of Mod Spotlights, I figured I'd start with something simple. And we're going to be taking a look at Mag Repack by Ooster. So what I've done is I've used my virtual arsenal here to grab a load out. I'm going to deplete some magazines just to like various degrees. And then I'll show you how the mod works. Okay, so if you check the top right now in my ammo count, whenever I reload, I won't get a full magazine, so all of my magazines have been depleted somewhat. Which is something you might find happening in the game if you reload quite often. The problem with that being that you might not then realize when you're about to run out of ammo. It tells you how many magazines you have spare, but not how much ammo is in each of the magazines. So I might end up at some point, I don't know, reloading this magazine? Meaning I'd just have 11 bullets, and I'd probably get caught out and killed. But with this mod, if I hit Control R, I'll take a knee, and this is the Mag Repack 3.1.3 window. I'm not going to go through the options because that's just a, a debug window and you can change your key bindings. But the mod itself is very simple. You have a drop down here, you can change ammo types. So you can see only like the 9x21 balls, that's my 9mm for my pistol. The same here for the 5.56, which is for my rifle. This is compatible with every modded magazine I've tested it with so far. So that's including things like RHS and Specialist Military Arms. So you have a source here and a target at the bottom. Say so for example, I want to get rid of this mag here with no bullets in it. I drag it into source. I get details about the magazine. And you'll notice that the 9mm mags have disappeared here, and we can only see compatible magazines. So you're not going to be stuck trying to work out which bullets go in which magazine. The mod works it out for you. And then, there is a magazine here which is almost full. What if I want to top this magazine off? I put that in target. And then it will, bullet by bullet, pack the new magazine full. And I now have... Uh, a full magazine. So if I were to reload... You see, I got 30 out of 5 again. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put all of the little magazines into the source here. And fill up as many mags as I can. There we go, so that magazine's almost empty now, but at least I have some full ones. So I've now gone down to 3 magazines in the top right there. I haven't fully depleted a single one by firing them. But the magazines have been consumed when I, like, take all the bullets out and put them in a new one. So if I did the same there, I could reload this, get a full magazine, then put that one into this magazine. And there we go, we've gone down to two spur. So it's a great way to steadily put stamina back into your bar over the course of an engagement. It's quite quick, so it's reasonable to do just for a couple seconds if your teammates are covering you and you need a fresh bag. And it's just a very nice, simple mod that I would mark as essential. And what I mean when I say that is it's a mod that I think is good enough and thus tall enough that I'd want to include it in all of my mod packs. So I will mention a few mods being essential as the series progresses. And once we get to a point, I'll release a sort of collection full of all the essential mods that we've got. And also this testing facility here, once we've gotten enough like additions on it and it's polished enough that I'm happy with it, I'll release this on the workshop too. But either way, Mag Repack by Ooster can be found in the description if you want to download it for yourself. And if you have any mods to suggest that you want me to spotlight next week, feel free to leave them in the description. I do have a couple mods that I want to check out, so... I'm not bleeding for ideas, 
but I always want to hear about mods you're interested in me spotlighting.